on? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cassie if you're new here and welcome to Cassie's castle for today's video We are going to be doing a styling video. This is a video that I've been working on for a while I just have had it in my head and I'm happy that we're finally doing it today Today's video is going to be an active wear Styling video if you're going on a Disney trip, especially during the summertime I think it's important to pack a lot of active wear like I love playing with fashion and I love doing like these fun creative looks for the park but I know realistically if you're someone that only gets to vacation at Disney like once in your entire life You're gonna want to be in comfortable clothing and I think activewear is definitely the way to go But I wanted to show you guys ways to make it look more elevated if you guys are interested in today's video make sure you guys give it a thumbs up make sure you guys subscribe for more videos and let's get started honestly this video should be sponsored by airy it is not but it should because 95 percent of my active wear comes from airy it's my favorite place to get active wear we're gonna start with biker shorts because biker shorts are great for the summertime especially if you're going to the parks it gets so 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 incredibly hot in the summer i remember i went to disney world for the first time two years ago and well, i can't believe it's been that long and you guys it was disgusting how the weather was like it was so hot and humid and i felt sticky and gross the entire time like i couldn't even think about what to wear besides comfy active wear because I just felt so sweaty the whole day and biker shorts are for sure a great thing to wear especially in Florida my goodness your weather there kind of crazy these plain black biker shorts these are from Aerie they're like crossover biker shorts so it kind of gives you like just like a more flattering shape right here in the midsection I do a matching black tank top I got deodorant stains on the shirt this is a sports bra tank kind of situation from airy as well and they have this in so many different colors so you're always able to mix and match however you want have this top in white as well so you could do like a black and white moment whatever you want i just went with black just because i know a lot of people like to wear black it's very easy and you can style it in so many different ways so we have this, but you can also do any other black tank top. It doesn't have to be a sports bra. It could literally be whatever you want. We're gonna throw on this white button up. This is from Shein, um, but you can get these anywhere. You can thrift them literally anywhere that you want. And this is a little bit wrinkled for now, but it's okay, you get the idea. So we have our button up shirt. I think when doing active wear kind of outfits, I really like wearing like scrunch socks or just like taller socks that you can just like kind of slide down and kind of give like that scrunching effect so these are actually they just come like in a pack of 10 from target i think they're by hanes but you can get them anywhere you can get them at walmart um you can also get some that are like pre-scrunched on amazon here's the base of the outfit um i am going to keep it very very simple and we're going to add these black there's tape on this i don't know why black mini mouse mickey mouse ears okay very easy i think the key when doing active wear especially is accessorizing as much as possible like doing gold hoops so right now i have like this mini mouse earring that's in my second hole um but i'm gonna add these gold hoops in the first hole both of these earrings are from marshall's i love getting jewelry at marshall's because i feel like it's really affordable and everything always just looks so cute so I really like getting jewelry from Marshalls, so these are like mini hoops from Marshalls. I'm going to throw on this necklace, which is also from Marshalls. Jewelry line that I like at Marshalls, um, either Bubble Bar, which is where I get the Disney ones, or I like like these more simple pieces. These are from House of Harlow. My Disneyland necklace, which this is from Disneyland. Wow, who would have thought? This Minnie Mouse necklace, which is from Bubble Bar at Marshall's as well. That's the jewelry that we have. We're gonna keep the same jewelry throughout the entire video to keep it easy. Now we need some sort of bag. It's a lounge fly. It's just this plain black Mickey lounge fly. I'm throwing on these uh, New Balance shoes. Super comfy, but you can do whatever shoes you want. Air Forces are always like a great go-to for me. Here's the first outfit. Like I said, I kept everything black and white for this particular outfit just because I know black and white is just easiest to style. It looks clean. Everything always just looks put together, but you can always switch things out and add pops of color. Another way that I like to style biker shorts is with t-shirts. La da dee, la da da. I've got a couple options just to get show you guys. So I have 
this one which is a tennis disney tee it is from h&m and then i also have this black tee which says thunder mountain on it this one is from rope drop threads this one which is also from h&m when you have disney tee you can wear the sports bra and keep it and then we're just gonna add this t-shirt over it you can wear a different sports bra like I said, the options are endless. So what it looks like with this t-shirt, super cute. I would style it the same exact way, same jewelry, same ears, with a black lounge fly. Lounge fly is from Collector's Outlet, by the way. Here is the um, Thunder Mountain tee, I think also is super cute. Um, yeah, it looks really cool. I'm actually gonna add some sunglasses to this one. So I have these sunglasses, which, is, which are from Key. Adorable, I love it. I'm like running out of breath, okay? <laughs> the last tee I'm gonna try on is the other H&M t-shirt. And here is. It's a little bit too big on me, but it's okay. I still really like it. I'm gonna take this t-shirt and I'm gonna tuck it under the sports bra. Once again, with the lounge fly. Very easy to recreate. You can do any Disney tee, whatever your heart desires. I love H&M for a Disney t-shirt, so you can definitely check out H&M. Um, you can obviously go to like Box Lunch, Hot Topic. I'm gonna show you guys how to style like a more colorful pair of shorts. So these are blue biker shorts. I did get a too small of a size on these, unfortunately. They're just not as stretchy. They're the same size as these, but these are a lot stretchier. Here's the next option. So I have the shorts on, and I switch out the top for a white one. I just feel like the white looks better with this color. I'm gonna throw on the white button up again. Super cute. I'm gonna add this fanny pack which is a Little Mermaid Stony Clover fanny pack, which I think will look really cute with this color. When I style fanny packs, I kind of like them underneath, um, like jacket, sweater, or whatever. I can't find the Little Mermaid ears I wanted to wear with this outfit. They're like the purple seashells with the sequin blue bow. I would have done those seashell aerial ears if I could literally find them I don't know where they could be so for now we're gonna do these purple ears and some purple sunglasses okay now we got some fun colors going on if you're more of a color girly but then as I was kind of looking I saw I had these ears which would be so cute these are up ears and I would still keep my aerial fanny pack because you won't really even see it but now you have more of like a Pixar themed outfit if you're more of a Pixar girl. I actually decided to throw on a t-shirt over the sports bra. And this is more of like a baby tee. Other shirts that I did earlier, those are more like oversized t-shirts, which I love. But if maybe you don't like oversized tee, I think this is also a really cute option. This is from Depop. It's a little jasmine tee, but you can get like baby tees anywhere. This is actually, I think, like a children's t-shirt. So I think it's super cute. And then I added my jasmine stony clover fanny pack with it, which I think is really cute. Um, I also have a jasmine nuimos which you can also like attach to your fanny pack if you want like a whole jasmine vibe going on once again i would do my jasmine ears and i don't know where they are here is the next fit i love it on to the next one another thing with biker shorts is sweatshirts yes it is going into summertime but sometimes it's really cold in the morning or it gets really cold at night so having a sweatshirt still looks really really cute i want to show you that you can also style your sweatshirts in whatever way you want so if you want to add like a turtleneck because it's extra cold during the time of year that you end up going to disney um i think it's also a really cute option the sweatshirt in particular it says the castle club on it and this is from my on my supply co you can use my code i believe it's cassie 10 if you want to save same basic black pair of ears add the lounge fly you could do a fanny pack stony clover fanny pack which also looks really cute so do whatever sweatshirt you can do whatever biker shorts i just wanted to tell you that you could also 
style your active wear with sweatshirts and it still looks super cute. I'm trying to find a specific pair of biker shorts that I just got recently and I don't know where they are. Last pair of biker shorts that we're gonna style are these pink ones which aren't necessarily like active wear biker shorts because they're made out of cotton. These are still great for just like everyday going out wear. We'll say these are a little bit big on me um, if I let them Kind of hang down they do feel a little loose at the bottom so i'm just gonna roll them up a little bit because we're gonna throw on a t-shirt so you're not even gonna be able to see it the bottom of the shorts they have like this lace here which i think is really cute especially if you're like more of a girlier girl you have a girlier style i'm gonna throw on this pink walt disney world tee so i got on mercari it's vintage but you could do any white t-shirt, pink t-shirt, sweatshirt, whatever. The t-shirt long, like a dress, all you see is like the lace kind of peeking out. And I think that's a really, really cute touch. I think it'd be even cuter if you had some pink shoes or like white and pink shoes on these Air Force Ones, which I always get questions on. These are from the boys section, like the little boys section on the Nike website. I want to do a fanny pack for this one, not a lounge fly, mainly because I want to be able to see like the back of this. I'm not sure if I want to do Toy Story Jumbo, which I will say a Sony Clover Jumbo is definitely more practical for an all day park day because the little ones, they don't really hold as much. I would use this more of like going for an hour or whatever and I don't need much kind of vibes. Different options depending on what your vibe is. This one is the Toy Story jumbo and then this one is a sleeping beauty one ears can you guess what color i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna do pink heavy sunny clover ears i think this will be really cute i love it and you're good to go this is such a cute outfit and i would totally wear this to disney world especially because it's so hot and obviously it's a disney world tee so i feel like i have to wear it there now that we've styled biker shorts a million and one different ways we're gonna move on to a different kind these are active wear shorts that give the illusion of a skirt but it's not a skirt they are literally shorts and once again these are also from airy and they have like ruching in the middle so it's super flattering and a really stretchy waistband which we love you're not so much of a skirt person but you kind of like the vibe of a skirt but you're not fully committed to a skirt I think this is a great option and they have this in so many different colors I got the pink pair because I don't have any like shorts in this like hot pink kind of color another great option would be white because you would wear white more often than a pink you're gonna do this with the white sports bra that I'm already wearing so the outfit looks like isn't this so cute I'm obsessed and I kind of want to get this in more colors they do have like fun colors like orange and blues and if you can do like really cute disney bounds with that and they also have these built-in shorts with little pockets on the side in fact we're still on it so if you see the tag i'm so sorry same sports bra as earlier and then i did switch out the necklaces so i added this pearl necklace with pink mickeys on it this is from bling strings you guys can use my code cassie15 you guys want to check them out and you can customize Whatever pearls you want, seashells, mickeys, different colors. I have this also like in a rainbow version, which is fun. But you guys know I love a pink, so definitely we'll reach for this one a lot more. We're going to do these bubble bar ones. He's so cute with these small world ears. These are kind of old and I cut the bow off, but I love it because it's more like hot pink and white which i love i would do this princess fanny pack it has all of the disney princesses on it like that which is also from sony clover i like the white better this white lounge fly matches a little bit more so here is the next fit super simple but like i said you can also add that white button up over it again do a t-shirt over these shorts but i just really want to show you guys these shorts uh, because I think these would be a great option for the park especially for like a girlier kind of style next we're gonna go into skirts I have two options we have this one from Target which I haven't worn yet because it hasn't been hot enough for me to wear them and I also have this one from Aerie personally I think the Aerie one is a little bit more comfortable because this band is just not as stretchy whereas this one is more of like a seamless kind of vibe so it's a little bit 
stretchier. Either option works, whatever your heart desires. I'm wearing the pink skirt and I actually have the matching top to this, which is also from Target. I think a matching set is always just like your best bet because you really don't have to think about it at all. So I love a matching set. I think this is really cute, but you can obviously switch out the top for whatever whatever top you want. I'm gonna add a little white cardigan over it. I think for ears, I'm gonna go with these Valentine's ears because I feel like the shade of pink matches the outfit really well. I think this is really a cute little outfit for a bag. I think I'm gonna do my Maria lounge fly for this one. I think this Maria lounge fly is really cute. And once again, I have the pearl necklace. So there's this outfit. And then you can also add like a little pearl headband in front. If you're a girly girl, I think that's really cute. I think this would be also really cute with like your hair down. But since my hair is already up, I'm just not going to deal with my hair. There's a really fun way to style your little workout outfit. Another way you can style this skirt is by adding a t-shirt on top. So I'm gonna take this baby tee, which is from Princess Polly. I think this is also a really cute outfit. It honestly reminds me of like an old school cheerleader. Just another way to style it if you wanna be a little bit more covered up. I think this is also a super cute option. You could do a lounge fly. Obviously the options are endless. You could do whatever color. So if you wanna do a blue skirt, you could do a blue skirt and Make it more cinderella theme. I actually do have a blue skirt, which is from Airy, which I've styled before in videos, but I'll show you guys again. I'm throwing the white sports bra back on with this blue skirt. I just think it looks better like this. What I think is really fun to do when you're taking like a Disney trip, like say you're going with a bunch of your friends, wanna be comfortable, of course, but then you also want to kind of play in to Disney a little bit subtly also i don't know where the sun went but it just got so dark you guys could all wear different color activewear skirts and you can be different princesses so like this would be like cinderella do a cinderella fanny pack just a blue fanny pack or a blue backpack or whatever and you can just say you're cinderella even if it's not like a bunch of characters on you if that makes sense I, these ears so this would be like a little cinderella bound and then you could have someone in pink and say they're aurora someone in green and say they're tiana just like whatever color everyone likes everyone could just have a different color which i think is really fun to do for a park day especially with like a bunch of friends makes it easy super practical another fun thing you could add is like a little bolero which is like super trendy right now with like ballet cork a gray one which is from amazon i think also looks really cute i mean if it's hot then you probably wouldn't even wear this you could do a white t-shirt instead of a sports bra another idea is like if you're going for like a bachelorette you could have your bride in all white like a white little workout set you can get like the little bride ears and just wear all white and then the rest of the girls can be in pink or in blue or something else which i think will be fun that's just ideas that i have um if you have like trips like that coming up this year skirts also look really cute with t-shirts i was wearing this all white outfit and then i wanted to throw on the tennis tee i think this is another cute option if you're not really a sports bra kind of girl and you just want something a little bit more loose just like any t-shirt would be really cute or the black ears again i think this is also a really cute option if you want to be more covered up i think anything that you would wear with shorts you could wear with the skirt for the most part like that see still super cute it just depends on what you are interested in so many fun options that you can do for the summer next thing that we're gonna style is workout dresses I'm not really a workout dress person i did buy some for this video specifically if i become a workout dress person after this but this one i actually found at airy or not airy i found it at marshall's but it is airy and it was 12 dollars. so if you want airy stuff you can go to marshall's and they have some stuff you just gotta really look here is this dress that i found it's all white and then it has these little cutout things which I think is really cute for $12 you can't beat that here is the workout dress on I will say it is a little bit big on me because it was the smallest size they had and it's not quite my size so I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it I might end up returning it but I just want to show you guys for today's video still super cute um it doesn't have any padding in it unfortunately so I would have to wear a sports bra I just I'm not wearing one right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this cardigan which I thrifted we're going to tie it in the front like this 
I think this is super cute. I think it's fun. Kind of spices up your basic workout dress. But once again, do the Cinderella fanny pack because I think it just matches really well. And then the blue ears, super comfortable. Do have like this extra layer if you do get cold. It's a workout dress. It does have the built-in shorts. So it's just super comfortable. And I really love this option. Next we have this black workout dress, which is actually from Shop the Poison Apple, which is a Disney small shop. And she did give this gift this to me for this video. So shout out to her. You guys can use my code Cassie. 10 if you want to save on this little workout dress super simple and basic which we love because that makes it easier to style when it's just plain the only thing i would note about this dress is that it doesn't have shorts so you definitely need shorts but it does have padding whereas the airy one didn't have padding but it has shorts so you gotta pick and choose your battles okay this little bolero situation which this is from forever 21 it actually came with a corset really cute way to style it because this is a dress i would do these bubble bar mini mouse ears to kind of add a little bit instead of doing just plain black because i feel like there's just so much black going on already so i think this is really fun to add I would wear my hair down as well because i think the bow just requires your hair to be down in my opinion and then i actually would do this white or like cream lounge fly really a cute option you know the one pro i will say about this dress not having shorts is that you could easily go to the bathroom whereas with the biker romper kind of thing or a dress that has built-in shorts you literally have to like undress everything to go to the bathroom I will say that is definitely a pro to a dress that doesn't have shorts underneath that is basically it for today's video i didn't style any leggings for this video i just feel like Leggings are pretty easy to style. You can style them so many different ways. I've styled them many, many, many times before. Hope you found this video helpful though. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe for more. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.